Ash Ketchum is one of the strongest Pokemon trainers of all time. And today we'll be challenging Ash Ketchum throughout his years, starting with Ash at the beginning of his journey. And we'll work our way up battling stronger versions of Ash until we take on God Ash Ketchum and his championship team. Oh my gosh, guys. And as you can see, we have noob Ash Ketchum in front of us. This guy looks hilarious. But of course, he's still Ash Ketchum, so he's very, very strong. But we gotta get some good Pokemon. But as you can see, we have 25 common lucky blocks. So we need to start thinking about what Pokemon noob Ash Ketchum might have. Because obviously Ash Ketchum's first Pokemon was a Pikachu, so he probably has a Pikachu. Ooh, Slowbro is a very good Pokemon. That is gonna come in handy. And I know in one of the first couple episodes of the Pokemon anime... Ooh, actually we got an upgrade. Let's go. A shiny Cub Chew. That is not very good. But in one of the first episodes of the Pokemon anime, Ash Ketchum catches a Pidgey and a Caterpie. So we should prepare to fight any of those Pokemon and their evolutions as well. Except for Pikachu, because Pikachu never evolves. But here we go, another uncommon block. Maybe it'll upgrade oh, a shiny Honex. That's still really good, though. We gotta remember, we're only fighting noob Ash Ketchum this round, so we probably don't have to have the best team ever. I don't think we need a legendary Pokemon, but we cannot underestimate Ash Ketchum, guys. He's literally the Pokemon champion. Come on, come on, come on. Ooh, a shiny Chansey. Guys, if that upgraded again, we would have a legendary Pokemon three in a row. Let's save our upgrades for the end. But yo, I think we're gonna make noob Ash Ketchum really look like a noob this round. We get a Simi Sage, a Nidorina. Ooh, Totodile, that is really good. Gastrodon, come on, come on, come on. Bear Tick and Ampharos. Five uncommon lucky blocks. That's a big chance for a legendary Pokemon. Hold on, we got a Serena. Okay, big chance for a legend. No, come on, can this last one please upgrade? Our last block of the round. Oh my God, Ash Ketchum actually had a Pidgeot. Is that a sign? A shield on. Dang! But here we go, guys. It's time to take on Noob Ash Ketchum. Oh my gosh. I'm not gonna lie. I'm a little nervous. I know he's just a noob, but it's still Ash in the flesh. Come on, slow bro. Oh my gosh, Thunderbolt's gonna do a lot. No! Yes, there we go, Slowbro. That's a huge hit onto Pikachu. Oh, and Slowbro goes down, but that's fine. We can bring out Gastrodon, which is a ground type. Ash Ketchum can't even touch us now. So Pikachu goes down. Pidgeotto is here, which goes down super easy in two turns. And yes, the final Pokemon is here, Butterfree. Can we beat Ash Ketchum's Butterfree? Crunch does a lot of damage from Dreadnought. But come on, Bear Tick. I need you to put the team on your back. Aqua. Jet, Butterfree goes down, and there we go. Which means Ash Ketchum has now upgraded to Pro Ash Ketchum. He is a lot stronger now. But good thing we now have access to the next strongest lucky blocks. Uncommon lucky blocks. We got a shiny Corsola. Okay. Ash, I will be back for you. Mark my words. But most importantly, with these new lucky blocks, we're only one upgrade away from rare lucky blocks. Let's see. Can I get one right now? Yes! There we go. We catch all these guys real quick, but this will be our first legendary Pokemon, and oh, it's not a very good one. It's an Articuno. Still a legendary nonetheless, and I'm very happy about that. But guys, make sure you let me know in the comments your favorite Pokemon of Ash Ketchum's, because personally, mine might be his Mega Lucario, unless we have to fight Mega Lucario. That is definitely not my favorite. But come on now, let's keep it up. We got a shiny Pelipper. Oh, a shiny Matang. If we can evolve that, that would be so good. Still have 16 of these uncommon lucky blocks. That's a lot of chances to add another legendary legendary Pokemon to the squad. Yes, we get another rare lucky block. Because this time around, I'm expecting Ash to have a lot stronger Pokemon. I'm talking Charizard. I know he had a Snorlax. That would be super scary. Heracross is another Pokemon, which sounds very intimidating to fight. So we need some more legendary Pokemon. Okay, there we go. A Lugia. I'll say our first probably good legendary Pokemon all video. Here we go. Can we get any good shiny Pokemon? We're yet to just get a good one. Oh my gosh, there's a Pikachu over here. Okay, that's gotta be a sign. That's Ash's Pikachu. Pikachu. We gotta open the rest of our lucky blocks in front of it. Come on, Pikachu. I know that means we're gonna get something good. A Wooloo, a Dodrio. Show me a legend lucky block. Oh, Pidgeot. That's another one of Ash's Pokemon. Okay. Okay. A Grookey. Oh, oh, oh. Okay. Legendary lucky block and a Feebas. Man. Okay. So that wasn't as good as I hoped. But it can all be saved with this one singular lucky block. Oh, our first epic lucky block of the round. This will be a shiny legendary Pokemon. 
And it's a shiny Articuno, dude. Are you kidding? There's a shiny Zygarde right next to us, too. That is just a slap to the face. We already have one of those. Not shiny, though, I will say. All right, but here we go, guys. It's time to build our team and take on Pro Ash Ketchum. I'm nervous. Now, let's do it, guys. Pro Ash Ketchum, you got nothing on me. Oh, he's leading off with Charizard. Okay, that is just fine with me. I am happy to be out here with Dreadnought. Yeah, let's get these crunches off. Let's go. Because Gastrodon can come in and go for a water pulse. Bye-bye, Charizard. I'll see you later. Yep, there we go. Ooh, but Sceptile is here. I'm going to my Lugia. Sceptile, you got nothing you can do to a Lugia. Yep, Leaf Blade. How about Aeroblast? See you later. Oh, he didn't die. Wow. That is actually very shocking news, but Snorlax is here. That is a scary Pokemon. Okay. Oh my god, this Snorlax is a tank. I can barely do any damage to it, but I think Simi Sage. There we go. We take it out. Oh, here's the Heracross, guys. Okay. Simi Sage, you did your job. I'm just gonna let you go down, buddy. Yeah, there we go. Adios. Articuno is here. I'm clicking Hurricane. Come on now, come on. Oh, Heracross goes down. Who's next? Don Fan? I got another Hurricane for you. Not so pro now, are you, Ash Ketchup? Of course, I miss a hurricane as I say that. Okay, I'm done talking trash. Ash, I know you're the pro man. Okay, but Don Fan goes down and we've been pro Ash Ketchup. Who's the pro now? And really quickly, guys, I recently made a new Roblox channel. And I think you guys will really like it if you enjoy Roblox videos. And there's already a bunch of videos for you guys to watch. So go subscribe if you like Roblox and want to support. Oh, God. And as you guys can see, Ash Ketchum has upgraded to his legend form. Oh, he's going to be so strong. Thankfully, our lucky blocks are also stronger, meaning we'll be getting, oh my god, if I get one more Articuno, I swear. What I meant to say was, meaning we'll be getting a lot of legendary Pokemon like Diancie, not Articuno, okay? But I will be back for you, Mr. Legend Ketchum. First things first, though, we got 23 of these lucky blocks to get through. This is so good for us, guys, because Ash's team just got a little stronger, and think of one Pokemon that Ash has that's OP. Immediately, I think of Ash Greninja, which is gonna be so hard to face. Here we go, though. We have a Raikou. Oh, we have two upgrades. I didn't even notice. What shall we get? There we go! We have a God Lucky Block, which gives us three legendary Pokemon every time. A Calyrex, a Shiny Tinglu, and a Regigigas. Hey, if we keep getting God Lucky Blocks, Ash Ketchum won't be a legend for long. And even after we beat this boss, there's still another stronger Ash Ketchum. So we need to make sure our team is getting stronger as well. We have Tapu Koko, Regidrago, a Type Null, and Deoxys. Wow, not a single one of those upgraded. I'm really hoping that doesn't mean we used up all our luck on the noob or pro rounds. Ooh, but a Giratino, that is very very nice. That will work so well on the team. We get a Tapu Fini, Cali Rex, and another Tapu Coco. I'm trying to think of all the legendary Pokemon that Ash Ketchum's had. I know at one point he had a Mel Metal. I guess technically that's a mythical. And he had an Agonadel, which is also a Ultra Beast. Oh my gosh, we just got Arceus though. And that is really good. That's amazing. We're running out of lucky blocks here slowly but surely. Hold on. Four more rare blocks on the round. Will any of them upgrade? I guess the answer is yes. All right. So here we go. Three chances at another God Lucky Block. Three chances at upgrading our team to the next level. We have Zarud, Volcanion, and a Tapu Bulu. Dang, only one God Lucky Block this round. And I believe our team is now ready for the Legend Ash Ketchum. Let's do it, bro. Oh, he leads off with Gudra. Oh, wait, that's a really, really strong Pokemon. Good thing the Yen Shao does a lot of damage to it. Oh, Dragon Pulse does a lot back, though. Please take it out with this Drain Punch. Yes, there we go. Good job, me, Yen Shao. Oh, but Hawlucha is next. This is definitely gonna take me out, right? Yeah, Hawlucha goes first, and me, Yen Shao goes down. Let's send out Ampharos, though. We can go for Discharge, Drain Punch. Oh, boy. Come on, come on, come on. Yes! Oh, my gosh, Ampharos just one-shot it. Oh! <gasps> But here is the Ash Greninja. Look at that sprite. That is an Ash Greninja if I've ever seen one. Oh my gosh, what's it gonna go for? Dark Pulse. That barely, barely misses out on the kill. And we just one-shot it. Ampharos is the goat. But Noivern is definitely a threat. Oh gosh, and Hurricane does a lot of damage to Lugia. No, and we're confused now from Hurricane. Come on. What is so confusing? We gotta beat Ash Ketchum Lugia, okay? And Talonflame is the 
next Pokemon. No, Lugia goes down to Talonflame. Okay, this is actually scary now. Good thing we have Dreadnought in the back because Head Smash will do so much to this Talonflame. So much. Uh, yes, Talonflame goes down and we win the battle. Legend Ash Ketchum. GG. But guys, of course that means we've upgraded to God Ash Ketchum, the hardest challenge yet. Oh my gosh, and look at the world. This is insane. We can jump so high here. Oh my gosh. But of course, since Ash Ketchum got stronger, so did our lucky blocks. And the first one upgrades to a god block. We got a fusion Pokemon, Spectralure, Tapu Fini, and some other Pokemon. I don't, what was our third Pokemon? I don't know. Either way, I don't care. Ash Ketchum, I'll see you, man. We gotta get some legendary Pokemon. Pokemon. And we need a championship team because we're about to fight Ash Ketchum from his championship run. Oh my gosh, yes. We have a shiny Rayquaza. That is so good. A god lucky block. So think of all the crazy Pokemon Ash had on his team, like Mega Lucario, Gigantamax, Gengar, and even Dragonite. His team is actually so strong, guys. But we just need to hope we keep getting strong Pokemon from these lucky blocks so we actually have a chance against Ash. Here we go now. Let me see if I can't just get rid of all our epic lucky blocks. Ben there done that. Come on. We want the god lucky block. Show me the customs. Show me the fusion Pokemon. Oh, and we should get a decent amount of them because we have eight god lucky blocks to break. That's basically just a whole nother round. Come on. We have Lugia, Cresselia, and Glass Dryer. Ooh, a Tinglu and a Suicune. What was the last? Po oh, Cosmo. Um, are you serious? The one Pokemon I don't want. Oh, yes! We got a Fusion, dude. Absol Tall. We got a Galaxy Verizian, too, but the Fusion? Oh, that's what I really want. Come on, now let's get another. Yes, Guard Decorai. A Fion that is trash. I'll take a Zeraora, though. Guys, I'm starting to get nervous now. We are running out of lucky blocks. That means we need to fight God Ash, catch him very soon. We are on to the last lucky block of the round. Show me a fusion. Whoa. Whoa. Not a fusion, but we get a galaxy Arceus, which just looks insane, but it's also going to be super strong. But here we go, guys. Let's take on the God Ash Ketchum. Oh my gosh. He's leading off with the Mega Blue Cario. Oh no, Heatran, I need you to live. Yes, Heatran lives and takes it out with the Heat Wave. Oh, but Ash brings in the Draco Fish. I don't think Heatran could do much to this. Yep, he just dies. Good thing we could bring out one of our fusion Pokemon. I didn't go for Angelic Lance. Super effective fairy move. And oh my gosh, Draco Fish still does a lot. Draco Fish is such a strong Pokemon. Like, that's so OP that Ash has it. Oh, but here is the Gengar Night Slash. Oh, it thankfully does take it out. But oh, Surfetched is here. Oh, Oh my gosh, Absol Tall just got annihilated by Surfetched. This is kind of bad, guys. We don't have that many Pokemon left. Let's go for Judgment. Oh, Arceus, it didn't kill. Okay, thank you. Surfetched is recharging, though, thankfully. Okay, and Hyper Voice knocks out Surfetched. There we go. But here is the Dragonite, guys. Oh my gosh. This is gonna be so tough. Hopefully, Judgment does a lot to it. Oh, but Dragon Claw does a lot to us back. Yes, come on, Arceus. Eat up the hit. I, I believe in you so much, Arceus. I need you to finish off this Dragonite right here, right now. There we go. And we've been God Ash Ketchum. Don't forget to subscribe.